seminar. Okay, Nya school ka ma'am? Kay pagkarot ma'am. Na? Kay pagkarot ma'am. Pagodin nasyonal? Ah. Dito kami sa Vegan Convention Center. Lawak ito sa building guys. Santa. Oo nga, nagkakasabay-sabay yung mga program. Di ba yung sama tayo, ma'am, niya? Well. Graduation da? Graduation da. Oo. So. Kapag gidanta elementary and high secondary, mata? One and two kami din, but one and two. Ah, siguro pinagsabay na ano. Mape ka, ma'am? Asik. Nagi start kan, mam? may mga daladalang laptops kung ano ba ang pagkagawa sa amin ngayon Diyos ko po 
ito. Mangungupya ako sa kanya pag mamaya. Siguro magagaling mga to. Maasahan tong mga shipmates ko dito mamaya. So, mangungupya ako sa kanila guys. Naku po, naku po. Ah, diba? Mga nasa 70 kami ngayon. Marami pang wala eh. 103 dapat ang participants. Pero 70 plus pa lang nandito. Yan, mag-start na yung first speaker namin. To discuss to us the features and tools of PowerPoint presentation, August 365 and 2019, there's a lot of Ms. Sherry Nagalini, teacher to of Sinai National High School. Thank you very much. Oh, ito ang aking mga kagrupo, mga puro barako guys. Doon kumpleto na. Oh, late kasi ako dumating. So, ito ang kagrupo ko ngayon. Gagawa kami ng SLK. So, grade 8, arts, fourth quarter daw kami. Grade 8 din doon, sir. Grade 8 ang gagawin namin. Ini ubra ini saya. Kalau mengenai tujuh puluh tiga, kalau mengenai extension itu. Tapi syarat dana. Tapi syarat. Tapi extension tu bini tin pa bulu tu macam banger. Bagaimana? Sakit ngarut aku bulu tu dengan men men. Kansen. Pwede kilos na Pwede one bag na 25 kilos 5 days na O merienda time Dito na tumtulada Good morning everyone Thank you so much Sir Alan Special greetings, of course, to our school's Division Superintendent, Sir George Emeriante. You might have tired, Anna. Okay, and also to our Assistant School's Division Superintendent, Sir Nestor Irania. My colleagues at the Division Office, we have there at the back, Dr. Elsie Ligunay. Our Education Program Supervisor for ESP. And of course, the formal person of this activity, Adult Subject. I don't know why. Under the K-12 curriculum, we know very well that mate could be taught by any teacher, even a teacher without a good quality of voice. Music could be taught by a teacher and also arts, arts or art subject could be taught by a teacher who is not also good in drawing. Do you agree with me? Yes, because of technology. Kaya nga Sir Joel is conducting this activity, digitizing MAPE lessons, so that anyone assigned to teach MAPE could teach well the subject and could develop well the competencies under this subject. Bakit kaya pagpasok mo sa isang MAPE class, hindi na kagaya ng in-expect mo na diba, if it is a music class, you open the class with a song, isn't it? O bakit hindi na nagpapakanta si teacher sa MAPE class niya? After the K-12, there should be an integration of music, arts, PE, and health in the MAPE subject. So that kahit na art subject yun, magpapakanta ka pa rin. There are songs which is about art, about health. Yun ang dapat gawin ni teacher. Huwag mong isipin na, ah, ito, drawing lang. Hindi. Using ito, 
ito, kanta lang, walang mag-drawing, no? So, we should be good teachers. So, take advantage of the training that is given to you by Sir Joel. Para kahit na hindi ka magaling na kumanta, hindi ka magaling na mag-drawing, ma-deliver mo pa rin ang competencies that you are required to debut to deliver under our topic. Okay, so my dear teachers, please make the most out of your stay here. Walang tutulog-tulog. Gawin natin pati sa ating trabaho because much is expected of you when you will go back to your school. Ano yun? Magre-re-echo kayo mga teachers. You will re-echo the training. You will re-echo what you have learned here to your co-teachers. Madaling makita o madaling... Yes, we could easily observe if there was no re-echo done in your school pag nagbisita kami. Why? We could see immediately dun sa ginagawa ni teacher kung may uh, integration of what was learned in division trainings with the actual uh, scenario, actual situation na makikita namin sa kanilang klase. Yes? Okay, so you expect a uh, napipitas niya klase nung pakanta kayo before you start your lesson. You ask somebody to lead a song for your class. I still remember uh, when I was still a classroom teacher. Okay. Uh, I do, uh, every Friday, ito ang ginagawa ko. Uh, I let my learners uh, sing. They go in front. I stay at the back. The whole class, I the whole time, the whole. Uh, Very good. Yes, if it is a 60 minute period, I stay at the back. One by one, nakarelli na yan, pag Friday. Anong gagawin nila? Mapantagkanta, sakong, sakyesa. Ang ginagawa ko, yung actual singing na binibigyan ko sila ng drink. So happen na, sila na yung si Sir Abdul Rosibi, yung nurse sa naglawaan. Yes. Yung mga mo din yan? Division nurse siya. Alam ng mga nurses yun. He was my human and sabotatorian siya. Ano kaya pa nagkanta? Kasi ang anapit na si Boses na iman. But you know what? No, ang kama pa nagkanta, what grade will I give you? Ang kagbalik na salot ako na yan ako. So, mapanlata niya sa ako, oray mo si Tonado, oray mo ilimitin ko ito si Katawa, Jenny Coden. Of course, I will not show also to the class that ah, I am already smiling. Kasi may pagpakita ang very good, palagpakan kung kung anong madagta. So, di ba, nakaka-encourage yun. So, nag-antay ni Abdul yung honor niya na salutatorian when he was in grade 6. Because of my desire na ipakita din niya ang namakabaso yan. Then, sir, for example, sir, mag-insert ka na sa'yo.